Oh my gosh, what's up everybody? Last night they dropped episode 16, I believe, of Love Island. It's the recoupling after Casa Amor, and it's the craziest thing I've ever seen in my life, ever. Like growing up, I watched American Idol, America's Got Talent in high school. This doesn't compare to, none, none of those compare to this. So let's just get straight to it. I'll show you what I mean. just gotta feel so bad for Kirsten right now like obviously Karen probably thought Kirsten's definitely with somebody I'm gonna kind of make it a joke but it didn't end up that way and he ended up looking like a bozo just making Kirsten looks probably feel so bad about herself right now because like she got her hopes up and then boom crash it's just really sad but This is how she reacted. Let's hear her speech. Hey, Kirsten, how are you feeling? Um, I mean, I'm not surprised because we did have our talk, but you know, you have to take it day by day in here. And it wasn't necessarily mutual for me. And like I said, from day one, I'm going to do what's best for me and do this with no regrets and uh, go big or go home. Right. You know, she, she even got so a little Kirsten, smirk at the end. And shouts outs to Kirsten, man. And after all of that, she still stays true to herself, says what's on her heart, and stays strong, you know. That's That's got to take so much courage. By the way, you notice she's wearing snake glass, snake earrings. And like I said from day one. You can't really see it in that photo, but... One. I'm snake earrings like she almost knew what was gonna happen <laughs> that's crazy last thing I want to show is kind of a glimpse of hope for Kirsten I mean you all know what happened to Connor I don't even want to make a video on that one that's just not even just a shame but you see Johnny going through a lot needs Caleb's advice. Looking looking pretty stupid. But let me know if you see what I saw when I first watched this. How did you present things? Basically, I think she already had an idea that I had something to Ooh. tell her. Did I think I it was gonna hurt it. the way it's hurting right now? No. Let's look back. How did you present things? Basically. I think she already had a look in the corner right here. Pearson and Connor just <laughs> laughing it out. You know, they've been through a lot right now. They're like, screw it. At least we have each other, which I'm so happy that both Pearson and Connor both had someone to talk about, talk to, and didn't feel like the only one that was left without a couple. So I'm happy about that. But at the end of the day, they both got done dirty. But if you stay true to yourself, that's all you can do for yourself. Um, tune in to the next episode. We'll probably either talk about... Let's just do Johnny and Caleb for the next... I mean, Johnny and Sully for the next um, episode. For the next video of mine. So I'll see you then. Boom. We out.